well today. They're feeling quite comfortable out here in this court. This is a 10-1 Venezuela run. And a two-point lead. Mello to tie it. And we're knotted up at 10 now. With Mello knocking down his first shot in five attempts. How about John Cox? Three of three from the field with a couple of threes here already early on. Cox is also losing part of his uniform game. <laughs> no matter. Jose Vargas is off. Mello with the rebound. That's Durant on the wing. Picked up by Gregory Vargas. That's poked away from Irving. Over to Mello. Back to Durant. And he'll try another three. It's off. Jordan. Once again, Team USA centers extending the possession. John Jay Jordan with a tough yes. offensive rebound. And Kyrie Irving, one of his patented finishes there. Probably the best guard at finishing around the basket in all of basketball, Kyrie Irving. Certainly be hard to argue that. Kyrie Irving is trying to become the fourth player in NBA history to win both an NBA championship and an Olympic gold medal in the same summer. Now, who, who were the other three? Uh, two of the other three played right here at the United Center. Michael Jordan and Scottie Pippen, who was uh, at the ballpark last night when we went to see the White Sox and Cubs. Right. And LeBron James is the third. Grotter roll off. The turnover by the U.S., but that's wiped away by Carmelo Anthony. And the U.S. wants to push. Mello. With, oh, with a trademark block <laughs> the game will not play him a few times strategically to try to get past the pool stage which would be a huge victory for this team no without a doubt and that, that was the plan get him in a couple of games against some teams some winnable games against some countries and possibly extend to the next round which would have been huge or could be huge if it were to happen for the country of Venezuela 22nd ranked team in the world according to FIBA but it's amazing man to beat that, that team Canada's Clay Thompson misses a three-point shot there but to beat that team with so many young talented players that Canada has Steve Nash obviously the general manager yep. of, the, of, of Canada and Andrew Wiggins Corey Joseph I mean, you have a lot of Dwight Powell. Kelly, o Kelly Olenek had 34 in that game. Kelly Olenek, another one. So that shows you something there about this team as John Cox, once again, 4-4-4 four for four from the field. Feeling pretty good right here now. John in Chicago. Cox is feeling it here in Chicago. Leads all scores now with 10 points as Thompson responds. We saw him get hot the other night in Oakland when he knocked down three straight threes in the fourth quarter. And after kind of a slow start, he came around on Tuesday night against China. You have to be in Clay Thompson's space as soon as he crosses half court with that kind of range. Offensive rebound to Venezuela. Gonna have to concentrate on John Thompson. Who's four four. The rest of his teammates are just one of nine at this point. Turnover there by Venezuela. Back comes the United States. Draymond Green now in the game. Hasn't played his best so far in this exhibition season. And gets it into Kyle Lowry, also just subbed in. Lowry will take it himself against the roll as the U.S. goes out 18 to 12. David Kubion handles, former teammate of Jimmy Butler's at Marquette. Turnover done as well. This is what the United States does so well. Draymond Thompson really just making life miserable. This is to realize they respect the teams in the NBA. It's a must. But DeAndre Jordan plays a little volleyball up there on the rim. He's got a handle on that FIFA rule. He, he likes that a lot. He likes that a lot. He wants to bring that to the NBA. But these guys, maximum effort. You know you got a guy coming in. He's going to play. You don't have to play heavy minutes. And uh, that kind of effort is going to prove successful here for Team USA. Cox still hasn't missed. Gives it up this time to Kubion. Gets himself into the game. But he's going to shoot. I thought he was too. <laughs> and he will this time. Clay Thompson short on the three. Again tapped out by the United States. This time by Draymond Green. Thompson patiently to the corner. Draymond for three. Well short. And here comes Venezuela. And Draymond has struggled with his shooting. Just a little 
into rhythm. But uh, Draymond Green, uh, I believe, will be a huge asset here as the team goes to Rio. He's just 2 of 13 in the exhibition season. So you know he can go small, put him at the center position, really switching everything. Uh, so having that versatility, multiple lineups is a must. Here's Cox. Hasn't missed yet. And now he has. He got too close. <laughs> John Cox, the son of an NBA player, and obviously a, of the scoring mindset in the team Venezuela. 12-2 US run to answer Venezuela's 10-1 run. Thompson looking out to it, but it's an off. And obviously stepping up to take the charge, but that, that might be the confidence to, to go up for a 360.